my area of expertise is in interventional cardiology. Specifically, I focus on structural heart disease. Uh, structural heart disease is a field of cardiology involving valves, holes in the heart. We basically try to fix things through a minimally invasive approach or a percutaneous approach without having to do open heart surgery. Typically, we see patients who are either referred from their primary cardiologists, cardiothoracic surgeons, primary care doctors, but we also have self-referrals from patients who are seeking a second opinion for their problem. And quite frankly, we've had patients come to us who have seen these amazing stories in the newspaper about what we do here and say, you know what, maybe these doctors can help us, whether it's through a minimally invasive approach or is there through a surgical approach. And the only way you can be sure is to get that opinion. Patients need to take charge of, them, of their care and get all the answers for themselves. The field of interventional cardiology has exploded with new technology and new therapies available for patients who traditionally weren't candidates for much. For example, aortic valve disease, if you were old, frail, and really not a good surgical candidate, you basically had a death sentence at that point. Medical therapy was not sufficient, quality of life got really bad, and patients ended up basically passing most of the time. We have these new therapies where we can put these valves in through the groin and provide a new treatment option for these patients. We also have new percutaneous mitral valve repair systems. Specifically, when the mitral valve becomes dysfunctional and very leaky, we can go in through the groin and actually repair the mitral valve without having to do an open heart surgical procedure as well. Furthermore, there are a lot of disciplines that help support our program including the surgical transplant program and the VAD program, which really helps our patients if we can't fix their valves, for example, and if they need other treatment options. All the ancillary services are there to help this patient. I think the cardiovascular care at Spectrum Health is top notch. I feel that the patient coming into Spectrum Health gets an assessment by multiple doctors as part of a multidisciplinary heart team. So we're talking cardiothoracic surgeons, cardiologists, uh, advanced heart failure specialists, anesthesiologists, imagers, uh, uh, nurse extenders, physician assistants, and, and they all come together to figure out what the best treatment option is for that patient. In my opinion, the patient benefits tremendously from that. I find that the most rewarding aspects of medicine when dealing with these patients are that the patients and the family members come up to you afterwards and say, you've given us our loved one back. To hear that from a family member or from the patients themselves, it's very rewarding, very gratifying, not only providing great care, but to see patients enjoy life.